In this video, I'm going to explain why 2024, god damn it. I'm here to explain why 2024 sucks a big one, mate. I'm going to tell you right now, the reason is because everyone seems to have a bloody opinion on everything and usually it's pretty, pretty negative. Like this one. Movies, songs, songs, songs aren't even the same anymore. 2023 at least was... Actually, no, 2023 was actually pretty boring. 2024, everyone has an opinion. It's usually negative, and it's always, it's everywhere on YouTube. Who, who watches the news anymore? I don't even think your parents watch the news anymore. You want you want entertainment, just go on YouTube. You want to you see what's going on in the world, just go straight to YouTube. Every Everything's there, from the Trump shooting thing to the newest movie that came out, which is apparently really shit. You know, the new Garfield movie. People had something to say. <laughs> People had stuff to say about that movie, I'll tell you that. I went to go watch it. It wasn't... Two, two. Mm. I like Garfield, and I even like the live action movies with um, um, what's his name? Uh, Garfield movie cast. No, not the new one. I mean, mm. Bill Murray. Sorry, I'm so sorry that took me so long to know. But I, I watched so I watched the Garfield movie. It wasn't too bad. It, it, it was more for kids, which mm, ugh, go figure. It was so predictable, and that's coming from me of all people. It's not just kids' movie that people are hating on. It could be any movie. The the new um, Kung Fu Panda Four. Wow, that people had stuff to say about that again. Not horrible. It, it, I had to go back and watch it twice just to confirm it wasn't that bad. But it, it, it was. There was no storyline. <laughs> I understand they brought back all the original villains. Not only one of them talked, but um, <laughs> and it was just it, the lines were very. I, I could have written them. Like <laughs> Zen, like the moment. Excuse me. The moment where Zen and Poe are in the rain, they're about to fight, and they go into hug. Um, like like she, like Tigris did to Poe in Kung Fu Panda 2. There was no emotion in it. it you knew it was the whole thing was going to be, the whole scene was going to be over in 20 seconds. It moved so quickly. Like the dads, uh, even, you know what? Even Master Uguay. Sorry. Oh, wait, that's right. He wasn't even in this movie, was he? Shifu. There you go. Sorry, the little red panda Shifu. Even he was very just... Everything was so watered down. Don't even get me started about games these days, mate. There's no good games anymore. All, all of them are literally... Just, it's it, the, new, <laughs> the newest games that you'll see out on the PlayStation, or Xbox, or whatever it is. It's another FIFA, Madden, or a bloody... One of those type of games with no storyline, no nothing. Like the last game we actually had that was really good in this world, I would say was... Oh, Red Dead Redemption 2 and GTA 5. I know I know there is a big age mm, gap between both of them when they were both released, but they were amazing. When they both came out, everyone was happy. Life was so much simpler and more fun. These days, everything's just online. I'm not going to lie, I, I play like The Sims, and anytime I see like a new expansion pack comes out, and I look at, I watch the trailer, and I go... I know this is a waste. <laughs> I know I know I'm gonna I'm gonna regret buying this. It just it, they make it look so cool, then you get the pack and it's where I am that goal. Kids these days versus kids back when, when I was a kid, I'd go outside and actually play with my friends. I, well, uh, you know what? They kind of do that, except they do everything on their phones when, when they're making TikToks, YouTube videos, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook. It's ridiculous. One thing I will say, one thing I will say in 2024 about social media in particular is the fact that you can, you can make money from it these days. That old saying about, oh, you know, uh, you can't make a living playing video games. <laughs> these days you can, can't you? Oh, know what? I'm going to even say this right here, right now iPod, uh, ugh, iPads aren't even a thing anymore. Well, this I don't know if that is just me, but honest to God, mate, everything is just on people's phones, a camera, and a laptop. That's literally what most people use these days. With Bluetooth, AI, and all that stuff, mate, k kids, they're just, they're getting so disconnected, and it's ridiculous. Like, there's a, there's an incident, there's a situation going on in Australia right, right now with, um, stabbings and stuff. You know, you know what my, do you know, do you know why I think that's happening? Because they are, have nothing else to do. I'm not going to get too into this, but the amount of genders and the <laughs> what you can legally, the amount of things that you can identify yourself as these days, legally, again, like if you get pulled over and you say, I, I identify as a shopping trolley, you can't go to jail for it. The amount of genders, mate, but by 2026, we're not going to have a clue. Kids aren't going to have a clue what the hell. 
<laughs> what the hell is going on these days? Like whenever I meet someone now, I say, you know, oh, hi, I say, hi, how you doing? Nice to meet you. Yeah, um, are you dating something or someone? Like, that's how it is these days, eh? The amount of genders and uh, the amount of people, like, I, I'm nothing against pe people of any gender, nothing whatsoever. The issue is the amount of, the amount of, people who disagree with all these genders versus all the genders that disagree back with them it, it's it's oh, it's just toxic mate and overall just 2024 halfway halfway through halfway through the entire year it's a shit show I, I, and this sorry this just hit me the amount of movies that they're making that that they announce you know new shrek 5 new toy story I've, I've lost count god forbid they make another ice age stop and even in Despicable Me, again, the reviews, well, you know what, I'm not going to lie, what, what, what did you expect? With all the movies that are coming out in the future, when they're announced, do you know what the worst thing you hate to hear is? Coming out in 2028, 2026, 2027, 2029. Why would you say that? You're, you're all getting a pay rise in the next four years. It hurts to hear, doesn't it? It's, it's, it's sad, you know? Overall, 2024, so far, shit show. We'll see how it goes. Hope, hopefully something changes. If you're enjoying 2024, let me know down below and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. That's all she wrote. Catch you later, mate. See ya.